Cases like this one where a person suffering from a mental health issue causes them to become aggressive when coming in contact with police is what a local department is working to avoid. The Abington Police Department has implemented a new program called Take Me Home. This program, along with uh, training that this department is uh, going through on a, a, a constant basis uh, in de-escalation. The department is asking citizens to fill out this form on its website with information about loved ones who suffer from mental illness. Officer LeVar Baxter has an autistic son and understands the concerns parents may have when their loved ones are out alone. So, you know, parents knowing we have a program like this kind of help eases their anxiety, their fears of their loved ones being out. The department says if the person's information is in the system, it helps police understand who they're dealing with. Maybe they uh, were nonverbal. Uh, maybe they were afraid of police officers. Maybe our uh, approach to them uh, put them in the defense so they don't want to talk to us. Officer Baxter says police can then make a more appropriate decision on how to proceed. That way, if an officer comes across an individual uh, we have difficulties uh, communicating with them for, for whatever reason. We can uh, look in this database quickly, try to ascertain based on the, what we're observing, what they're wearing, their height, their hair color, uh, and, and match it with a photo. The department says families responded to the program within hours of putting it up on its website. So far, the response has been overwhelming, appreciative of the program. We've got, uh, I think upwards of about 10 families already that's already inputted the information. The department says the new program is another tool to help police officers do their jobs better when in contact with someone suffering from mental illness. Regardless of the situation, we're responsible for making sure that they get home to their loved ones uh, safely and quickly. The Philadelphia chapter of the National Alliance of Mental Health Illness says it supports Abington's program. Abington Police Chief says other departments have contacted him about the program and plan to follow suit. Now for more information go to NBC10.com responds. Harry Hairston, NBC10 Responds.